Yeah. All right, how about this one? Let's say you're abducted by aliens. All right. They haul you aboard the mothership, take you back to their planet as a curiosity. Now, would you rather be in their zoo or their circus? I gotta go zoo. I feel like I could set more of my own schedule. In the circus, you get to ride around on the train, see the whole planet. I'm wearing a little hat, I'm jumping through fire. I'm a little alien heads in my mouth. At least it's show business. But in the zoo, you know, they might put a woman in there with me to, uh... You know, get me to mate. What if she's got no interest in you? Well, then I'm pretty much where I am right now. Just got to take a ride on a spaceship. <laughs> So, uh, Jay Peterman wants to hire some of our cartoonists to uh, illustrate your catalog. Well, we're hoping that if perhaps the catalog is a little funnier, people won't be so quick to return the clothes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, for example, I, you know, I really do... Well, I love this one. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's a rather clever jab at inter-office politics, don't you think? Uh-huh, uh-huh, yeah. <laughs> Why is it that the, that the animals enjoy reading the email? Well, Ms. Ben, is, uh, cartoons are like gossamer, and uh, one doesn't dissect gossamer. <laughs> well, you don't have to dissect it. If you could just tell me why this is supposed to be funny. Oh, it's merely a commentary on contemporary mores. <laughs> but what is the comment? It's a slice of life. No, it isn't. A pun? I don't think so. Wolfstein? That's not a word. You have no idea what this means, do you? No. No. Then why did you print it? I like the kitty. <laughs> you know what? You people should be ashamed of yourselves. You know, you doodle a couple of bears at a cocktail party talking about the stock market. You think you're doing comedy. Actually, that's not bad. Oh, really? <laughs> yes. Well, you know... I I have others. <laughs>